Justin, how heartbreaking was that? Yeah, very. Yeah, it was good, um, obviously a good hard game and um, we just fell short. Where does it leave you now? Oh, I don't know, disappointed, that's for sure. And yeah, that's, that's how I'm feeling. Uh, you know, we tried hard and obviously um, you know, created a couple of chances, made a big break down the right hand side, didn't convert. It, was ne it wasn't a game for many opportunities, you know, both sides really struggled to get out of their own end due to some really good defence from both sides. And, uh, and come down to a field goal, we missed ours and they got theirs, so that was the difference in the game. Why Patrick Herbert was? Why was he the man to step up? Yeah, like, Paddy's obviously sort of backs himself a lot. He you know, fancies himself kicking goals as well and, and kicking field goals and things like that. So he, he was always confident in it. But I don't know why we had to throw it 20 metres backwards for, for that to happen. And then they're the things we've got to get better at. And uh, that's why we didn't win. You didn't use um, Fafida until late in the first half. Is that always the plan? Yeah, it was. Yep. Yeah, I think a few times he's come off the bench, he's come around that 30-minute mark, so um, that was the, the plan for tonight. It was OK. What did you make of um, Tyrone Petch's performance in the halves? Yeah, I thought, well, it's exactly sort of what I expected. He sort of plays that way anyway, so... Um, yeah, as I said, it wasn't a game for many opportunities. It was struggling to, to get out of our own end, so uh, there wasn't many chances there tonight. And, um, as I said, come down to a field goal and, and we weren't good enough. What about Tino? Was off the field late, Justin? Was there a reason for that? Usually, oh, he's just he played so many big minutes tonight. Yeah, well, I don't know exactly how many minutes, but he was out there for a long time. So uh, he was enormous for us. Did a great job. There was a play in the first half of Jaden Campbell where he got taken out chasing his own kick. A lot of calls for a sin bin there. Do you think it was worth a sin bin? Yeah, I'm not sure. I've seen plenty go for him, and that's why I thought it was a try scoring opportunity. But I don't know. What do you say to this team now? Obviously, if you, if you win next week, there's still a chance and things have got to go your way, but what did yeah, you say? Yeah, I couldn't say much. Thanks for the effort and we'll, we'll reassess tomorrow. And um, and then, as you said, we'll sit back and see if results go our way over the weekend. What about on Campbell? The way he's played, I know it's a, it's a sour note tonight, but it's a shining light, the way he's performed at fullback seems to be getting more and more comfortable but I guess it poses a problem as well because you've got AJ not playing at the moment have you thought about how you fit him in Campbell probably moving forward in the next season Oh look he's been terrific for us as you said and, and he was great again tonight so um, look we'll hopefully can get them both in in the long term um, but you yeah, know he's just got to do a good job for us um, at the moment at fullback and then we'll, we'll look at it uh, for next year Philip Sammy back in the side, I think he made 180 plus metres. What did you make of his performance? Yeah, I thought he did a great job, Phil. Exceptional. You know, he's, he's been out for a few weeks and as I said on a night that it was tough to, to make any metres, he, he did a great job of it. So I was really happy with, with his effort.